Okay, on today's episode of Amazing or Not, we have the industry standard NRG short wheel hub, and then we also have the Amazon $50 knockoff. Both of these wheel hubs are needed to install an aftermarket steering wheel, like a Momo or Sparco or something like that, or even if you wanted to add a quick release onto your car for track or racing applications. This NRG wheel hub has been around for a long time. It's probably the shortest one that's offered on the market besides this, which looks like a direct copy of it. And I've been running these NRG wheel hubs in all my cars for 10 or 15 years now. So let's start unboxing these and see what they look like. Okay, we're gonna start off with the NRG one. I will say both of these are for the E36 platform, but both of these companies do make them for pretty much any chassis out there, not just BMW, if you have Honda or Nissan or anything like that, they still make these as well. So let's open this up. Okay, so inside it does come with the electrical pigtails for your horn, which is really nice. And the hub. Some pamphlets. And a sticker. So the NRG one is what you would expect. I'm very familiar with this product. It's really good uh, machining. It's got a really nice uh, powder coated black, uh, almost like a textured finish on it. Um, these are aluminum, not steel. And then it has the threads that you need for your steering column a situation. Once you install this on your car, your, the steering column nut will go back on and then you can install the quick release onto the six bolt pattern. Now that we've seen the NRG one, let's move on to the Amazon one. All right, here's the Amazon one. Like I said, this is $50 on Prime. You get two day shipping for free. It looks very uh, familiar inside. You get all of the same pigtails for the horn. Uh, looks like this one does come with hardware, which is nice. You did not receive that NRG one, but if you buy the NRG quick release, it does come with the hardware, I'm pretty sure. It seems to be packaged pretty similarly with the bubble wrap. And here it is. Okay, so looking at the Amazon one, it feels about the same. Actually, this may feel a little bit lighter, but I'll weigh them in a second. Um, as far as the machining, it looks really nice. The finish uh, is a little bit more glossy, almost like a satin, where the NRG is a little flatter. This is aluminum as well, and it does have the E36 spline for the steering shaft. Let's take some measurements, but just from first looks, this looks to be an exact replica. Okay, so here they are side by side. And as I said, they look almost identical. Like this company bought this product, took every measurement and, uh, and replicated their own. But just to make sure, I do want to take some caliper check just to see if it is an exact replica. And then, uh, you know, you can make your decision of what you want to do. So starting with the NRG one here, I'm not sure any of these measurements really make a difference on your car, but it's more to see if these products are just an exact replica of each other. So we'll just do the diameter here. It's about 80, 80 millimeters. Diameter here. Yeah, 79.8, so 80 millimeters. Okay, now we're looking at the thickness just from the mounting flange to the back of here. And we get about 28 millimeters. If you look at this one, that's a little thinner. So about 27 millimeters, but still pretty close. Now, one thing that I did notice is uh, even though these both have a six bolt pattern, these holes in the Amazon one actually look a little bit bigger. Now, they did provide the hardware for it. So obviously this should screw in fine. But the ones in the NRG one actually look smaller. No, it just looks. So it still fits in the same as well. So the only physical difference that I can see besides a little bit of the paint finish is NRG one provides a dot at the top, which is nice because that's your uh, top dead center where this one does not. So when you're installing this onto your car, the steering wheel straight, you want this at the top of your steering wheel or this one, you could have a possibility of putting it a different way. 
And then when you mount your quick release, it could be off a little bit and you'd have to pull off the whole thing and reinstall it. Where Energy thought of a head and uh, this would be the top and you wouldn't have any issues with that. So those are some things you want to think about. I'm just giving you another shot here to show you. They are the same heights. Um, they're the exact same diameters. They're really the exact same part. So, so I'm not really seeing the benefit to buy an NRG one, which is $120 versus this one's $50, but I am seeing the benefit of giving uh, the company who created the product, you know, their money versus someone that just kind of stole the product. So you choose uh, whatever you want to do, but I'm telling you right now, they're exactly the same. And this is about $70 cheaper. So I appreciate you guys watching and uh, I'll see you next time. Thanks.